what we say here. Man's eating dinner still. Little curry go on them thing there. Get me? What we saying now? Let's talk Mustafi, blood. Let's talk Mustafi, blood. Fish and chips thing. Nah, blood. Curry go. You get me? Rice and peas. You're done now already. But yeah. Let's talk Mustafi, blood. You understand, my car? He's still here, blood. You get me? He ain't going nowhere. We're in problems, fam. You understand? Oh, I don't know. What does Emery do with him, blood? You understand? We can't play Mustafi and Louise, blood. That would be carnage, fam. Be losing games like 9 0, blood. Or 9 3, because we got the front three. Using games 9-3, blood. Be crazy scoreline, so I can't even be doing that, blood. But Emery, Emery don't want Mustafi. But we, we're stuck with him. This man's on 80 grand a week, you know. 80 fucking grand, blood. Man's just sitting there on his 80 grand a week, loving life, fam. Driving around his little Ferrari of his girl, fam. It's a joke to him, blood. Fenerbahce didn't want him. Galatasaray didn't want him. Juve pulled out. I don't know what's wrong with the Italian teams, you know. Big man team. Bacard, they, took, they took Mickey. They took Smalling off United. They tried to take Mustafi. But then them man there, because the Italian league is so slow, they'll probably boss it over there, but that's a mad thing. Sanchez. But what are we going to do? I'm eating curry goat. Curry goat, rice and peas. Bagging team. But, yeah, what are we going to do, blood, with Mustafi? We cannot play him. You understand? I don't want him on the bench as well, blood. I don't want him on the bench. I'd rather put Chambers on the bench and put him blood. But he's just there 80 grand a week. We bought this man for 35 million blood. You understand? Terminate contract. It's not as easy as that blood. You understand? Reserves. Yeah, I'm, I'm with that. Me, personally, I'll just let him rot in the reserves, plan. You understand? Then try... Sell him in um, the summer. Because I don't probably... I don't think you'll be able to get rid of him in January, if we're being real. I don't think that's happening, blood. You understand? But maybe in uh, the summer window, we can try to push him out again. But it's a joke, fam. It could, because this is the fuckery now, yeah? If Socrates, um, Louise, Holden, Chambers, if two of them get injured, yeah? Oh, my God. It's going to be Mustafi and one of them, blood. I seriously don't know what to do with this guy, blood. Nobody would literally take him. Like, nobody. Nobody. No one wants him. Even on loan. No one. You understand? I'm surprised we got rid of Mickey blood, to be honest. You get me, but... You know what the worst thing is, yeah? When we first got... When, when we got Mustafi, yeah? Everyone in the fan base was gas blood, yeah? Don't chat shit. Yeah? Everyone thought we were getting a top defender, World Cup winner... Can play right back, can play centre back. And when he first came in, he was on he was on job blood. You understand? He was on job. Him and that dickhead Koshoni had a great partnership up until he got injured. Uh I think he got injured before we played Everton away when we lost 2-1 and then we lost to City 
on the Sunday, 2-1, because we went up to Everton on midweek. We lost that. And then we went up to City on the Sunday and we lost that. And then ever since he came back from injury, the guy's been all over the fucking place, blood. You understand? Like, I seriously see why he did not make it at Everton, blood. You understand? And even when we bought him, yeah, we never took heed, blood. Gary never come out and said, I remember G never had him when he had that so-called managerial <clears throat> job at uh, Valencia. Because he weren't managing shit, blood. You understand? And even he said, um, when we were getting Mustafi, man was saying, yo, you man are really going to pay 35 million for this brother? 35 million for, you man are really going to buy 35 million to, for him? We never took the heat, blood, you understand? And <clears throat> now look, blood, we've got one of the worst defenders in the fucking world, fam. Like, we have one of the worst defenders in world football, cuz. It's as real as that, blood. You understand? When we first got him, I'm eating curry goat. Fucking hell, blood. How many times do people have to ask, bro? Sorry, you probably just joined the live. I don't know. I'm just assuming you've been here from the get-go. But yeah. Uh, yeah. When he first come, he was on job, bro. I don't understand how a man can get injured and just lose all capability of defending. Because when he first came into the club, blood, he was immense. He was immense, blood. Like, I was like, raw. We finally got a centre-back, blood. Like, we finally got a proper centre-back. And then, obviously, he just had a good start, blood. And when, when he got injured, the, the real him came came to uh, uh, came to light, blood. You understand? Fucking donkey. Simple as, blood. Fucking donkey. Can't defend shit, blood. You understand? Thank fuck, yeah? Real talk. Not even banter, bruv, yeah? Thank fuck he wasn't there. When Ozu and Kalazanak had the mad thing, blood. Because them and they can't defend nothing, fam. You understand? Thank God for Kalazanak, blood. Yeah, because Mustafi would have run when, blood. Um, he would have run when I left them, blood. Real thing, fam. The guy can't defend nothing, blood. You understand that? Like, big man thing. It's, 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 a, it's a shame, bro. It's, it's, it's a shame, bro. Like, there was so much hope and promise for this brother. You understand? And... He's just been a fucking joke, blood. Like, an absolute fucking joke. Like, man cost us top four. For me, he's the reason why we, we, we're we not in the top four, blood. Because the way my man just let Zaha run through, blood, in, in that fucking Palace game, blood. Him and Xhaka are the fucking reasons, blood. Him, Xhaka, blood. And Emery as well, blood. Em Emery's got a bit to blame, because he never set out his, his, his stall right. You understand? There were certain games at the end of the season last year. He was doing some stupid lineup, putting fucking Oleni in there, blood. And then fucking idiot there, you understand? But, yeah, man. For me, Mustafi, I don't want him near the squad. I don't want him, I don't want him nowhere near this team, blood. You understand? Another thing I want to talk about uh, is we just touched on him. It's Granite Xhaka, blood. I know we spoke about him yesterday, but um, I've seen Emery's comments. And Emery's basically saying that um, he doesn't check stats. Uh, Granite Xhaka is his captain. Granite Xhaka is a leader. He believes in, in Xhaka. And uh, Xhaka is, uh, or should I say, Xhaka will not be dropped. Now, for me, yeah, I, 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 he's not going to come out, yeah? As a manager, you're not going to come out and you're not going to coat off your player in in uh, public, you understand? Unless you're a mad manager like, I don't know, Ian Holloway or, or Mourinho when he starts calling up, man, you understand? Unless you're that kind of manager. And Emery ain't that kind of manager, innit? He seems like he likes to keep things in-house. But, bro, like, for me, yeah, number one, he shouldn't be the captain, blood, yeah? Not even forget the captain thing. Number one, he shouldn't be playing, Yeah? He shouldn't be playing in this fucking midfield. He should not be playing for this team. He should not be playing in this league. He should not be playing in that stadium. He's shit. Yeah? Fucking shit. Yeah? Simple. Shit. Number two. He should not be the captain of this club. The captain of your team 
The captain of your club, yeah, is a man that people respect, yeah? Not just the players, the fans respect him, yeah? Pundits respect him. Other players respect him. Opposition players, I'm talking about. Not his own players. Opposition players, blood. Respect him. Who the fuck respects Xhaka, blood? If any of them and they're in that changing room respect Xhaka, blood. I don't respect you, man, fam. Simple as. Because for me, the man is not a leader. The only L that man is, is a liability. He's not a leader. He's a liability, blood. Yeah? Since we've had this man, yeah? We bought him in 2016, yeah? The 2016-2017 season is when he came to this great club, yeah? That's when we bought him, yeah? From Much and Gablak, yeah? He has committed the most fouls out of any player to play in the league since he has arrived, yeah? He has given away the most penalties out of any Arsenal player in that time, yeah? He's given away, I think, seven or five, was it five or seven? Five or seven penalties this brother has given away. Yeah. He don't sit in front of the midfield. Yeah. He don't set up goals. Yeah. He don't lead. You understand? All he does is give away the fucking ball every fucking minute. Give away a goal every fucking minute. Do that stupid ass tackle in the fucking box. Yeah? Who does that, blood? Yeah? My six-year-old won't even do that, blood. You understand? Will not even do that, blood. Yeah? But this fucking man is supposed to be my leader. My cap... He's supposed to be my Tony Adams. Are you fucking mad? He ain't my captain, blood. He ain't my leader, blood. Fuck that, blood. Real shit. You taking the piss, from? Don't get me wrong. I'm Emery in. I'm Emery in the whole the whole way. Yeah? But that means I won't question him. Yeah? That don't mean that I won't question him. I'll question his blood clot. Yeah? Trust me. Because for you to come out with a comment like that about Xhaka, yeah? When he has... All the things I've just stated to you, like, is what he's done, yeah? And you got a man coming out and saying, oh, um, yeah, he's my leader, he's this, he's that, uh, da, da 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 Nah, bro, like, you understand, people are trying to, what does that say? Sorry, what was that? Troops, not that I'm trying to compare the two players, but remember how Rashvi and out of control Vieira was in his first few seasons for Arsenal. Xhaka provides something in the midfield that we don't have. Okay, let me tell you about Vieira now, yeah? Don't ever compare Granit Xhaka to Patrick Vieira, yeah? Don't ever in your life, blood, yeah? Granit Xhaka could never even play in a team with Vieira, blood, yeah? Because he doesn't have the capabilities, blood. He don't have the levels, fam, yeah? He, 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 only, he, he can only dream, yeah, of, of playing in a team with man like Vieira, yeah? You understand? So let me just get that out the rain, yeah? Patrick Vieira, yeah, was very rash in the tackle. Uh, and he would lose his head, you understand? You, and you could get under him quick, blood, you get me? But Vieira was a leader, yeah? People respected Vieira, yeah? Opposition feared Vieira. Opposition respected Vieira. Nobody respects Xhaka, blood, yeah? Nobody fears Xhaka, blood, yeah? Xhaka soft. Yeah, Jack is soft, blood. He's soft. Not even man like fucking. I don't know. I'm trying to think of a shit player, blood. He plays in the Premier League, fam. That proper dead, fam. Proper. Um... I don't know. But you get my drift. Yeah, Vieira would. Protect the back four, yeah? Vieira would set up goals. Vieira would score goals. Yeah, Vieira could pass a ball. Yeah, Vieira wouldn't give away stupid goals. Yeah? So you cannot compare the two. You understand? You cannot compare the two, blood, didn't it? I will not have that, blood. I will not have that slander in this, in this live stream, fam. You understand? Man actually said fucking 
Man actually tried to compare Granite Xhaka to the great Patrick Vieira, blood. I am fucking done, G. I'm done, bro. I'm done. You understand? And that's the problem with this club, blood. It's people like it's people like that, blood. With the, the, you come back with this stupidness, blood. Trying to compare fucking Xhaka to Vieira. I'm a Vieira, yeah? A man that won the league title at Tottenham and at Old Trafford. Yeah? You're trying to compare Xhaka to that, blood. Yeah? Xhaka ain't even won a game at fucking... Um, Old Trafford or fucking uh, Shy Art Lane. But you're trying to bring this little idiot into my legend blood. Granit Xhaka will never be a legend in this club. Never. Yeah? Never. Never. No matter what he does from now. Yeah? That guy's a donkey blood. Yeah? He is the worst midfielder I have seen at my club. Yeah? He's worse than Denilson. Yeah? He's worse than Danielson and him, man, there, blood. Yeah, he's worse than Kalstrom. An injured Kalstrom is better than Xhaka, blood. Like, I'm not having it, blood. Like, this guy is dead food, bro. I've had enough of it, blood. He's absolutely dead food. And he... Uh, it's, these fucking mistakes, bro. Like, constantly. Constantly, blood. How the fuck are you doing this? Like... This is why I bun hella loud, fam. It's man like Xhaka, blood. I swear down, I'll probably go to the game and dash my phone at him or something, blood. I swear down, fam. Like, it's mad, blood. The guy, fam, he's just such a liability, bro. It's unbelievable, fam. You understand? Him and Mustafi, blood. I just... <clears throat> Mustafi, we know he's not going to play. That's good. But... Xhaka, fam. Pff, he must have nudes on Emery or something, blood. He must have something on Emery, fam. Because I don't know how this pussy all I get in the team every week, blood. I don't know, blood, innit? I seriously don't know, fam. You get me, but... Yeah, man. If, if, if anything else pops up, I'll do another live. You understand? Because it's international week, innit? So there ain't fuck all going on, blood. You get me? Little man's got his first day back at school tomorrow. That's good. You get me? Uh, happy for him. Get to go back to school. You get me? I get some fucking freedom as well, blood. Some peace and quiet. Yeah! But yeah, man. Um, Mustafi and Xhaka. The duo continues. You understand? But yeah, man. You lot already know. Subscribe to Tubes TV.